is calculus two really that much harder than calculus one? Let's discuss in this video. So first I'm gonna say the answer is definitely yes. So as a student, when I took calculus one and calculus two, I was very lucky. I had a very good professor who I liked very much. And so my experience was great in both classes. I actually loved calculus two. I was very good at it. However, when we got to the disc and shell method in Calc 2, I was totally confused and I never understood it as a student. As a teacher, I have noticed that the grades are significantly higher. You know, whenever I taught Calc 1 versus Calc 2, I always noticed that grades were higher in Calc 2. In fact, kind of a funny story, uh, I actually taught Calculus 2 before teaching Calculus 1. My, my dean at the time asked me to teach Calc 2 and I taught it never having taught Calc 1. And I remember my first time teaching that class, how hard it was for the students. And even after that, it was hard every semester. And so I think the reason it's harder, it's a weird reason because it's the same book, right? You know, the same book is used for Calc 1, 2, and 3. So why is 2 so much harder? It's because the integration techniques that you use in that class are just more involved than the ones you do in Calc 1. Also, you do calculus with conics, and you do infinite series, and you do stuff like the disk and shell, and some applications involving integrals. So all of those things, I think, are generally just harder than the topics that you study in a Calc 1 course. So yes, Calc 2 is harder than Calc 1. It is the hardest, I think, of Calc 1, 2, 3. However, I do think that Calc 3 is harder conceptually, but the actual computations are generally easier in a Calc 3 class. But yes, to answer the question, Calc 2 is definitely harder than Calc 1. Take care.